All right, so Dave, first off, you know, this is a huge recognition. What are your general thoughts on getting into the Hall of Fame, I should I'm, say? I'm just, you know, I'm, I'm proud of the, you know, and honored, and at the same time humbled by being, you know, at a place where there were so many other great athletes, too, you know? And so what got you into gymnastics growing up? Uh, it was an activity at lunch in junior high school. You know, instead of eating, we'd go out to the bar pits and swing on the bars. Did not know it was a sport at that time, but you know, I, a couple of years later, I found out that there was a sport over at the high school that was called gymnastics, and they were doing what we were doing, so. You mentioned your time in the Olympics. What was that whole experience like for you, getting to compete there, and oh, you know, what was the atmosphere like? It, it, was, it was a lot of fun. It was, you know, it was a lot of hard work getting there, and I, and I had that as a, as a goal from early on. In high school, I did want to do that, and there were a lot of guys that were working out in the Southern California area that helped me get there. A lot of people here helped me get there as well, you know, including not only gymnasts, but people that I met here in Michigan, my my roommates here to visit with me now, and he was, you know, he was, he was an inspirational guy too as well. You know, speaking of your roommate, how did you get to Michigan State? Um, I met George Sapula through a previous gymnast at Michigan State here, Stan Tarshish. He was a high bar champion, an NC2A high bar champion. So, and he introduced me to George my senior year in high school. So, and uh, you know, how much have things changed on campus? It must be nice being back here and seeing yeah, stuff. Yeah, a lot, a lot. I can remember uh, being in a field across from uh, a uh, few acres. It was like a, it was like a field. You know, now everything that's out there to the to the south is, you know, it's really grown a lot. And finally, can you uh, can you still get up on the pommel horse? Can I still get up on the pommel horse? No, but I did do a knee circle last week on the bars with my uh, granddaughter. And uh, for a few years after uh, after the Olympics, I I could do uh, double leg circles on a pool table. <laughs> you know, but uh, kind of stayed away from the gym. <laughs>